Seriously, I was so happy that I went to church.
look look at this when i was cleaning my body as i was cooking like it's not for the faint-hearted i'm sweating okay hold on i'm gonna show you badly so i'm gonna have my bath in i have my bath before i eat my food and i will see you guys when i see you oh. <laughs> what I have chosen for you.
Happy Sunday. I think it's the last Sunday of February. Today is uh, 20 what? <laughs> Not even so sure, but today is the last Sunday of the month. So something happened in church. Seriously, I was so happy that I went to church today. You will not understand my joy. <laughs> you will not understand my joy. Or you may, if you are someone that grew up in church, you were like you grew up in a family that fears God and he was like always uh, happy to go to church every sunday you don't understand and then all of a sudden you cannot make it to church because of work and blah 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 and then you're no longer working and then you can now go back to going to church yeah so i was happy going to church today and i have a little advice for you so when you go to church you still need to be careful because some people are not there to serve god they are there to steal because something happened today my hand is hurting <laughs> something happened today um in church so when i got to church i sat down and after like few minutes was my sister and i went to church together and after like a few minutes into service um two to three guys um they were looking really unkept they came to sit like this um <laughs> behind us and i just had a very strong feeling to like pick my handbag because my i was packing my handbag because it was obviously on the seat and i was standing yeah we're standing we're singing we're worshiping and then these guys i knew i knew my spirit just told me or no the spirit of god just told me to pick my bag or like be watchful because these people are here to steal I heard it clearly and I told my sister the same thing. I said, these people are here to steal. Okay. So later on, Sha, I took my handbag, I put it in front, but in a way that was not like really uh, English done, they had new. Would not like let them know that I did it on purpose. But anyway, after, after some minutes, they stepped out. Okay, after close of service, they were doing like second praise. I didn't want to stay for the second praise. So I told my sister I was going home because I was so pressed and I was wearing a jumpsuit. And you know how crazy it can be when you're putting on a jumpsuit in public and you don't want to use like a what public to toilet. Happened to my what? Bathroom. Nothing happened to my front camera. The back camera is clearer. Yeah. Yeah, so... <laughs> <laughs> Being a content creator is not easy. I want to finish my jeans before I get to the gate. Yeah, I'm going to the market, but I won't be vlogging. It's going to be chaotic. Yeah, so um, when I step out of, stepped out of the church to go home, I cited these two people, two of these people out of the three that I saw. They were caught, like they were like strapped. Their hands were, or one was strapped. He was, he stole somebody's ATM card and somebody's phone. So, yeah, that's the gist. Be careful, guys. But well, means be careful, be careful. When you go to church, put your handbag in front. Like, you cannot trust everybody. See, the church is welcoming. The church will welcome anybody. Anybody. So, the church is like a hospital for sick um, people. So, it's for unbelievers. So, believers. So, the church is welcoming. So you can't just assume that everyone in the church are upright. So when you are in church, be careful. If you're in a church where they don't put pockets in front of you to like put your stuff, just um, 
make sure to like put your belongings in front of you in a way like on the floor or something where you can see them yeah basically that's it so bye guys <laughs> Thank you.